Hello YouTube. This is gonna be a replacement on my original PS4 controller. I'm gonna be using the YCC Team controller. Both are very good. You gotta have remove all the four screws on both controllers and prime it open. It's a little bit hard to open, but nothing that cannot be done. As you can see, the shell on the original controller, the, the battery cell is different. It has a plastic enclosure. The other one is just like a China-made battery. It has some a glue uh, holding in place. So you may need to have a screwdriver. Very carefully prime it up and remove the batteries. My PS4 controller battery is very bad, so I'm gonna use this uh, third-party controller battery in, in place of the original one. I really have this YCC Team controller as my backup controller, so it's okay to have a kind of old battery in it. As you can see, the original PS4 controller battery has this plastic enclosure, the other one does not. Capacity capacity wide is rated to be very similar so I'll be using this uh, YCC team battery in my original PS4 controller see if the battery life uh, has improved with that so after I've just replaced very simple step uh, I, it, it's already on as you can see the lights there just put the controller back together snap in place be careful that uh, uh, backlight over there so it's a very simple process and put these screws back in place and you're done so I'll be running some tests with this uh, I'll let you guys know if uh, uh, worth doing that instead of buying a new battery as I said this uh, white controller white CC team is my backup controller so it's okay to have a bad, bad battery in it as you can see it also turns on consider subscribe if you have not or leave your like if this helped you somehow. Thank you.